YouTube, 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 YouTube. What's up? It's your fave T Bros and I'm back. Ah! All right, y'all. I'm not a dancer. We all know this, okay? So don't even come for me. I have a special guest today. I'm here with. Golf drops. You feel me? Just hit 13.5k like a couple minutes ago, actually. He lit. He lit. Like, I'm trying to be like him when I grow up. So today, we're going to be doing turn offs and turn on. Okay? Okay. So let's get into the video. Boyfriend in 2019, you posting that nigga on social media. That's all God. Okay, but what if you posting your nigga on social media? Hell yes. Would you post your boyfriend? I only posted him twice. Exactly. You posted him still. That's what I'm saying. That's Kevin. Okay, maybe you just wasn't watching her story or something <laughs> oh, the day she yeah. posted no, him. No, no, no. Feel me? If you have a boyfriend, you lie to me. I mean, you're you gonna regret it because in five years from now, I'm gonna be a millionaire. But just. Oh, he's yeah. short. Feel how you feel. All right. A bad attitude is a big turn off, okay? Listen, I have an attitude, you got an attitude. We both can't have attitudes, baby. How's it gonna work? How's it gonna work? It just don't. So you're done. You're such a character, bro. Like, <laughs> she's actually funny, bro. I swear to God. Okay? Second turn off is girls that try to use it for their money, bro. Like, that's a big turn off. Like, if she knows I have money and she try to use me just for my money, that's a huge turn off. Like, stay out my DMs, stay out my life, period. Period! Period! Another turn off is when guys have no confidence. Listen, first of all, don't even try to approach me if you ain't got no confidence, okay? And when I say confidence, I don't mean like being cocky. But like, you know. You know I'm cocky as fuck, I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god. Anyways, go ahead. Okay. Um, yeah, if you have no confidence, it's just not gonna work out. My next one is like a girl who has kids, like. I'll be on Tinder or some shit. I'll find a badass girl like, shit, I'm about to smash. And then she'll be like, oh, I got a son or I got a daughter. I got to block your stupid ass. I don't, if you have kids, Why please. Why you got to block them, though? <laughs> if you have kids, I'm not fucking with you. I have not taken care of your you. badass son or your badass daughter. What if they take care of their kids? Go ahead, okay. go ahead. I'm not an asshole, I promise. Sometimes. Another turn off is bad hygiene. Listen, you got to get your hair cut. You got to. Feel me last week, though. You got to keep your. You gotta keep yourself up. I don't want to smell you musty, and don't hug me if you're sweaty, cause I'm gonna, I'm gonna get tight. I'm gonna get out, and I'm gonna want to fight. Okay. Next. This one is like, I hate when a girl's on social media 24/7. Like, some it's all right sometimes, but if you're posting your Instagram, Snapchat story every single day, doing every single time you make a move, like I don't want to see that shit. Just stay off the of social media, at least just a little bit. That's it. I feel a little hurt. Because like social media, it's not my life, but it's like it's your life. Go ahead. It's not no, my life. Don't cap. Don't it's cap. not my life, but don't cap. She capping for y'all right now. What's, what's I, don't your, the glam my, fam? I don't she, lie to she my glam fam. The glam fam. Oh, I don't God. lie to y'all glam she fam. Cause y'all know it's glam fam and no fam. On well, period. Soft niggas. Okay. <laughs> Listen. Don't don't have me curse you out and you just like okay and go cry about it. Like put me in my place. So are you a real nigga? Right? Exactly. What the fuck I'm talking mm. about? Another one of my turn offs is a girl who's in a whole bunch of beef. Like she talking about she fought her, she fought her, she fought her and fought her. Like if you fighting everybody with a whole lot of beef, I don't want to be none of that bullshit ever. Another turn off is when guys don't have goals. What are your dreams? Your aspirations? Talk to me. Tell me what's going on. But you don't have none, so you're a Another turn off of mine is like, if I meet a girl like from I DM her on Instagram or Tinder and she let me smash the first night, then you think she gonna, I'm gonna talk to her like the next day or like a week after. I'm not gonna talk to you. I just smash. I got what I wanted. Like, why are you in my DMs? <laughs> Your turn off. What? <laughs> what the hell? Okay, you're turned off. Sorry. So if you fuck the first night, you if, just... if you let me fuck the first night, I'm not messaging you. I'm not, not going to send you another message again in my life, unless you say you're pregnant or unless 
Unless I caught something from your stupid ass bitch. Use protection, because I, I damn sure you're good. Yeah. Another turn off is when guys are cheap. Listen. At the end of the day, I could always ask my dad for it, but if you're my man, I'm supposed to be able to come to you for anything. You shouldn't have to ask me. What? I mean, not me, but like, you shouldn't have to ask. Like, if you're my girl, you shouldn't have to ask me for shit because I'm gonna just give it to you. Right, but cheap guys don't do that. You should be able to do what my dad does for me, and if you can't, then you're a dub. And next up, another one of my turnouts, if you got no ass, in my opinion, like, the ass is like the top, the most important thing. If you got no ass, just. Stay out of my life, please. Stay out of my lane. Just. He don't want you. I don't want you. Don't so want you want a girl life. with a BBL? What's that? A Brazilian butler. I don't know about all that's fake ass, right? Yeah. Nah, I'm good off the fake ass. Oh, he don't want. He want that natural rap. I want that fucking Jamaican. He fat want that baby, jiggle jiggle. Pop, pop. That's what the fuck I'm talking about. That's what's it? Men just don't. Stand for me later. Going crazy, crazy. I got what you need. I'm gonna give it to you, baby. Going crazy, crazy. Feeling for me. Please, oh God, please, my bitch. Real hot girl shit. Bro, she is Both so period. bad in Mexican style, you know. I'll put two kids in her. It's no cap. Dope. If you got a gay best friend, like, I'm I'm sorry. I can't be around that shit. Like, no, no offense to any gay people out there, but, like, if you got a gay best friend, this nigga coming in my house, like, that, that ain't it, chief. Like, so you're homophobic. I'm not, no, I'm not. <laughs> Let me put that out there. I'm, I'm not homophobic at all. I love all gay people. If you're gay and you're a fan of me, I love you. But it's not like that. But if, you, if you're my girl, you can't have a gay best friend. It's, wow. it's a dumb so you trying to choose her friends for her? I know you seen that clip on Twitter where it's like that gay nigga, he was in their house like, uh, bitch, but he's really smashing that girl. You seen that shit on Twitter, Instagram, or something like that? No, I didn't see it. Hey. <laughs> I don't think I have any more turn offs. I ain't writing anymore down. Okay. Um, I'll finish mine. Okay. Another one is if she don't got her, if she don't got a lot of family, like, no, 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 not that, but if she doesn't like her family, like, I feel like. I'm a family, like, if I'm if, if I'm gonna marry you, like, I'm kind of a, like a family-oriented guy, like, I love my family, like, I have two sisters, my mom, my dad, my grandma, like, I love my family, like, if you don't fuck with your family, your family don't fuck with you for some reason, more than likely, it's probably you, so I'm not gonna fuck with you, yeah, that's it. See, it's not good to assume, what if, what if it's her family? I mean, shit, I'm still not gonna fuck with you, I'm not just playing. This guy, it's I said hard for you to find love. <laughs> Let's get to turn ons, okay? Okay. Yeah, I'll go first. You want? I'll go first. Okay. Number one, the way you dress or your swag is very important to me. Very important. <sighs> Feel me? Slight flex. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> shoes don't mean nothing. I mean, shoes do mean something, but listen, you gotta know how to dress to fuck with me. Okay, one of my turn ons, if you got good hair, like, I don't know what it is, but every time I see a girl with curly hair, like, that shit just, I don't know what it is, it's like, in my head. What? What, what, good is your, hair. what is your definition of good hair? If it just, if it looks good most of the time, I don't, I don't even gotta be a real, you can have a weave in your head. That, it just gotta be good, it gotta be good hair. Good hair is healthy hair. Good, good hair. Listen, all my girls good. out there, don't matter what curl pattern you got, it don't matter. If your hair is healthy, then you got good hair, sis. Don't don't let him tell you different. Don't let him tell you different, because guess what? He's wrong. I'm right. Wrong. I'm wrong. Right. I'm right wrong. and I'm Mr. Wrong. Right, you feel me? Wrong. If you're very social, I don't, well, not too social, but I don't want a guy who's like to himself too much because like, they're like, oh, where your man at? He home, he ain't want to come outside. No, <laughs> what? You're lame. Like, I can't even take you nowhere. Like, you gotta want to be able to meet new people and stuff like that. Turn on if, if a girl's very educated, like if you're in college and you're like trying to become a nurse or like a doctor or a dentist, like I really, Thanks. I really fuck with that. Like if yeah. you're in college, like what I'm doing, I'm actually about to drop out right now. Do this YouTube shit full time for a year, see how it works out. If it works out, it works out. If it doesn't, cool. Well, I'm at school. But if you're in school and like you're making good grades and you're actually like about your shit, I'm really gonna fuck with you. Like, yeah, that's it. So you gonna drop out of school for YouTube? Hell yeah. New video coming, announcement, you feel me? One year. Okay, another turn on is when they're respectful to their mom. If you don't respect your mom, then you're not gonna respect me. And that's just it. And I'm not here to I'm not here to raise no man. I'm not. That's your mother's job. And she should have taught you how to respect a woman. And if she didn't, then you cannot 
mess with Tanaya Heaven Washington. <laughs> you put your whole name out there? Because they got to know. One period. Like, it's going to sound weird, but like, I'm kind of sure I'm like 5'8", five, 5'7". Five, like, if she's shorter than like 5'1", like 4'11", type shit, like, if you're around that height, like, I'm fucking that. So you want a short girl? I want a short girl. She got to be thick, too. That too. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> um, another turn on is when guys have goals. I mentioned that if you don't have goals, then I don't want you to, like, you know, I don't want a guy who want to be running the street. I do like hood guys. I do. I like them. But I don't want you to be. I don't want you to be running the streets 24-7. Like, yeah, Nipsey Hussle type. Like. You used to be a hood nigga and met people on this shit afterwards. Like, right. Out the streets. He got his life together for his family. Another one of my turn ons is like she actually said this too, but like if a woman with goals, like if she she wants to become a doctor, like she gonna become that doctor. If she want if she want a car, she gonna she gonna get that car. If she want a get computer, she gonna go buy the computer. You feel me? He mentioned this when um, there's excuse me when they're smart and in school. Uh, excuse me, y'all. I'm a very gassy person. But yeah, I need you to be in school. Like you could be about your money, but you. <laughs> I didn't think she saw that shit. I saw it. <laughs> but yeah, you gotta be in school. So, gotta be hitting the books. Gotta be sharp. Um, period. Because I'm very smart. I can't be with no dummy. You got no smart clothes, you feel me? Yep. I'm not the best in shape myself. I'm kind of chubby, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> this is facts. That's how it is. But like, I'm trying to get in shape right now. I'm in the gym like once, twice a week just trying facts. to get right. right? Like, gym. Yeah, I'm trying to get back my body like to how it was like before I got like this. But you, if I'm dating you, your body gotta be right. Like you can't be like no, no offense, you can't be no sloppy ass bitch. Like that sounds so bad. Like I'm off, Language. I'm off for body positivity, all that. Like you can have saggy titties, no ass, two, three, three hundred pounds. But just you can't be, you can't be sloppy. I'm sorry, no offense. None taken. It doesn't apply to me. It doesn't apply to you. And if you take offense, it applies to you probably. You're rude. Everybody has preferences. Oh God, everybody. You're rude. I told you I'm an asshole. Everybody has preferences. I just can't be with no like big girl. I like guys who are very family oriented. Like I love family. I want a big family. I want like six, eight, twelve kids. I'm lying. I'm lying. <laughs> I want like yeah. I want a big family. So oh, if you no. want to be with me, you gotta want a big family. Husband. Why? <laughs> so I'm like throwing a hot dog down the hallway after eight kids. <laughs> <laughs> You're <not> funny. <laughs> My next one is you gotta know how to put your phone down. Like a girl can like be out with me for a day. We can go to the zoo, we can go to see a movie, we can go to a restaurant, we can actually have a real conversation and she's not gonna be on this thing twenty four seven. That's one of my biggest, biggest turn ons. Like I love that shit. That's all. I like guys who about their money. I ain't gonna judge you for what you do, but Get your money how you get it. On period. Unless, no, nah, let me not say that. Unless what? Unless you're selling drugs, that shit's gonna catch up to yeah, you. Yeah, it is. That shit it is gonna catch up to you. It's gonna catch up to you. Like, make your money. If you're a plug, go ahead and make your bread, but like, it's probably gonna catch up to you. You can't stay in these streets forever. Exactly. Like, you gotta, you gotta have like a legal hustle. That's how I really feel. Okay, my next one is she gotta know how to dress. Like, you can't be, you can't be going out the house every day and so baggy ass sweatpants and a baggy ass t-shirt looking like grimace that fucking big purple you get from mcdonald's you gotta you gotta be wearing like you gotta be cute shit like sun, it's sundress season i'll be excited it's sundress season fucking not with this rain not with this not rain this but still weather. but like you gotta be wearing like cute shit like i'm talking like crop tops leggings just you gotta dress like cute. you can't be like you can't be looking sloppy no offense okay. i'm a simple girl i don't answer too much oh loyalty Loyalty, loyalty, Thanks. loyalty. You gotta be loyal to me, to everybody in your life. It's important. It is. You gotta be honest. One period. I got a big one right here. So another one is like, if she bisexual, like, if she like, if I can have a threesome, it's gonna sound bad, but like, if I can have a threesome with you, like, that shit is like, God, send me the right woman, please, oh God. But yeah, that's a big, that's a big one. Also, you gotta be really smart, you You can't be like, you can't be like, if you have $50, you can't spend your last 50 on some nails when you need to eat. 
pay rent, pay your car note. Like, you gotta be smart with your money. Yeah, but what does she need a feeling? Over the rent or the car note? You can pay it. <laughs> oh I'm God. kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. And then the last one is good music taste. Like, you gotta have some good music taste. I can't yes. listen to like, I'm not trying to listen to rap all the fucking Honestly. time, like 24 7. Put on though. some Jill Scott, Facts. some Erica Badu, put on some, some Alicia Keys. Put on some flavor. I guess that wraps up this video. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like this. I'm sliding off the camera. Make sure you like this video. Make sure you comment on this video and you subscribe and you press the bell. So Make sure you subscribe to my channel too. I just hit 13.5K. He famous. Famous, famous. Not famous, famous. I'm famous. 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 Low key. High key. But anyways, y'all, appreciate y'all watching the video. Slide drops here at T-Rose. Yeah.